So this is just going to be a simple old fashioned. This one's super easy to make at home. Well, all these are easy to make at home. Actually, that's why we're doing them at home. So just call it Mike's Whiskey Bar because, hey, I got a map that says Mike's Whiskey Bar. So the ingredients in this, we're going to have some simple syrup. We're going to have some Angostura bitters. And I don't know if that's saying that right or not, but it is what it is. We're going to use Elijah, Elijah Craig whiskey, which is always a good choice. Uh, we're going to have some uh, we're going to have some maraschino cherry that's going to go in it and uh, then we're going to uh, top it off with some orange bitters so super easy just a few steps here we go so i always like to put the bitters in first a couple dashes whatever you think you know you can try more or less but not doesn't need a lot and you got some simple syrup that's going to go in and i, I I do cheat. I've got the, the measurements on there because I'm not a professional. So uh, we're going to put a half ounce of simple syrup in. Then we've got our Elijah Craig whiskey. And we're going to go with two ounces of Elijah Craig whiskey. Notice I'm pouring this into a uh, into a stirring glass. I already had some ice already put in here, and then this one. I think this is pretty important. You want to get a real, real good stir of all those ingredients that you put in. So really get that going around. You'll feel the glass get cold as you do it. And once you have that done. And I've already taken the time to uh, put a ice ball in here, which is, you know, you don't have to use ice balls, but hey, kind of cool. So there you go. And then we'll strain this into the glass. Make sure we get it off. Don't want to waste any. And then you can come back with a cherry. If you like to have cherries in yours, you can. You don't have to. Sometimes do, sometimes I don't. Get, get the cherry with just a little bit of syrup on it. Put that in next to, or put that into the glass from there. Take your orange bitters, garnish right on top. I use that instead of an orange peel because I don't like to waste oranges. There you go. Cheers. <laughs>